Good morning. It's uh, Wednesday, July 27th, as you can hear. It's raining outside. We had storms again last night, throughout the night rather. And um, with the lingering rain this morning, I did something I've done never done in 56 years of my life. And <laughs> put on my chacos, my sandals, and nothing else except for I guess I had my Apple Watch with me and I went outside and I had a shower shower and um, it's kind of like a religious experience you know you just uh, it's you nature the mosquitoes and the rain and uh, scrubbing with soap and a, towel, a wash rag and uh, trying to get as much cleaned as you possibly can without freezing and without uh, uh, getting bitten too much by the mosquitoes. Um, it felt so liberating, so soothing, so good to have running water across me again. I've been using the towelettes and baby wipes and all that to keep me clean and fresh the past uh, couple of weeks. But, um, gosh, these rain bath, rain showers, rain baths, whatever you want to call them, um, add a whole new perspective uh, <laughs> to camping out in the woods and really, really um, roughing it off grid. Now, I have bought a uh, five gallon um, shower bag that's supposed to be supposedly solar heated. Um, basically you hang the bag and it's got a black side to it and supposedly, uh, maybe some crystals on it that attract heat and that's supposed to warm the water within the bag. But I haven't gotten to the point of where I could hook that thing up yet and string it up and, and set up a nice place to do such a function. Um, I probably need to get some pavers to do that so I can stand on um rock rather than in the dirt getting my feet dirty as i'm getting cleaned and um set up some walls around it for all the people around us or the animals around us i guess you know goes back to the old adage that allison lot uh mary lot and larry lot used to say back in montgomery alabama if you seen if you see something you haven't ever seen before shoot but um nobody did it was uh it was an interesting night macy is getting much better she's right here um and taking um being outside during the storms as you may recall from the earlier video she um actually spent a night out there once and a day and a half out there when um she decided to wander and uh didn't and was having much more trouble walking. Now, I weighed again last night, and I was down to 316 um, from 332 just before we left Dallas. And um, I'm hoping that those numbers go down again. I didn't want to get the scale out in the rain and get it wet, because it's not supposed to get wet. And it doesn't do accurate readings when it's wet. But regardless... Um, it took me 56 years of life to get out and be brave enough to go stand outside naked in the nature, in nature, in the rain, and take a shower, and thank goodness also for one of my rain buckets, um, that provided some extra, uh, water for the wash rag and soap, and, uh, it was quite a thing to do. Um, so if you've never tried it, I don't know if you've got the abilities to in your backyard ever <laughs> or what. Um, it's quite a liberating experience. Um, I know y'all are thinking the guy's gone crazy out in the woods. But really, um, there's nothing like having a shower from fresh, clean rain falling out of the sky and cleansing the outsides of your body and uh, getting the bug spray off and any dirt and anything else that's collected. Um, gosh, and bug spray. 
I've been using so much of that and I've smelled a little bit too much of that. I'm starting to get worried I'm going to get cancer from it. And that's, I've, that's actually a possibility. So um, I'm actually going to do some looking into... I thought you're supposed to have DEET um, sprays that were above 50%. And this one's only 40 So that's something I'm going to look into when we get into town here in a little bit. Um, I've got a lot of videos to upload. I will be going to somewhere that's upload friendly and uh not patronizing somewhere that's not so um got a busy day i uh have all but maybe like three inches by two of a section of bark to shave off of the bit the second bed post um i'm letting that i had that sit out all night in the rain um, I need to get the bucket and, and put some bleach in it and scrub the um, rest of the wood, or all of the wood again. Um, but I got to get some gloves, and I'm not sure this is outside Clorox or not, so I'm probably going to pick up a dollar bottle of that when we get into Walmart and uh, into town. But anyway, I just wanted to share you with you this um, unique experience. Um, if you've never tried it, I highly recommend it. You will feel, um, humbled. Uh, there's nothing to fear about being seen out here because, you know, there's nobody else out here but me and Macy and she stayed in the tent because she didn't like the rain. So, um, yeah. A very interesting semi-religious experience of being one with nature truly one with nature and getting cleansed by the purity of nature it's a it's a quite of an experience so um i'm gonna end this one short seven minutes wow um chandler said you know show videos of you doing something and i decided that yeah probably not so much not for this one um so um i want to shout out to my three daughters chandler claxton chandler elizabeth Reagan Lee and Haley Ann and tell you guys I love you very much mom and dad I love you very much and my brothers and sisters sister who are um against me being out here I love you guys too um thank you to my friends who've been supporting this channel um thank you for that one lady whose name I write down and then I can't ever recall and shame on me. I'm going to put it in the comments uh, or the description below and say thank you. And uh, next time I'm going to do a sign that I put up somewhere back in here. And um, I may just do, once I get your name, I'll do one just specially for you. So thank you, everybody. It sounds like it's going to try to... Um, you can't really tell if it's raining harder right now or if it's just blowing in the trees. But I think it's actually raining harder now. So, um, thanks for watching. We'll talk to y'all soon.